Terry, is there alive in, in Germont? Did anybody get hurt? Thankfully, Kimberly, thankfully, the man who lives in the home, he was not injured. However, tonight, Detroit police, they aren't sure if the people who broke in are hurt or not. Pacing the back alley behind his house, Corey Watts can't believe what happened while upstairs inside his Boston Edison home. I hear probably like some rustling, and then I just hear a loud boom. And then I came straight downstairs, they seen me, and then they just took off running through the alley. The busted deadbolt to the back door is proof of the frightening ordeal. Two men broke inside, but they were met by Corey, pointing what they believed to be a gun aimed at them. Is this is a BB gun. Corey told police the men tried running to this Ford escaped, parked by the alley. But as the men took off, neighbors did more than see them running. We heard the gunshot. Uh, we saw the two guys run down the alley to here. Detroit police say reports of a gunshot came during the same time of the home invasion. When they arrived, they only found the getaway SUV and no one injured. Protected my house and they ran away. Okay. Did you fire the shot? I heard shots, but I don't know where they came from. Police can't uh, determine if the oh my God, I'm a fucking go. Nearby surveillance shows the people driving the SUV first parked out front.